ambapo tuna mengi tuliyokuandalia kwa kipindi cha dakika 30 hivi naitwa Cecilia wa kesho Mathuva karibu Muungano wa maendeleo ya wanawake unataka kuhusishwa kwenye vita dhidi ya janga la corona kwa kuchangia kugawa misaada kwa makundi yaliyoathirika zaidi. Aidha muungano huu umepongeza hatua ya chama cha Kanu kuungana na chama cha Jubilee ukisema ni dalili ya ukomavu wa kisiasa. Walizungumza muda mfupi uliopita. We also want to say that we are very grateful. Many people seated here we were in Kanu in 2002 and before. And we want to say old is good, old is good. If it is in your, I believe your excellency, as you did the march with the chairman Gideon Moy, we want to say that it could be our saving grace as a country. Maybe the Lord is directing you, you giving you wisdom to bring peace because this is the party of our founding fathers. We also want to say we have seen many parties come up in the last 18 years. And we know Kanu stood for love, peace, and unity. If it is time then to reflect after 18 years, then so be it, and Mandeleo will support. So we are grateful for that thought. The women are a pillar to the every nation, and it is their duty to be respectful, so that the uh, children should emulate what the women are doing. I was perturbed yesterday seeing the women in parliament making noises and say women have been, uh, uh, have not been, they, they've been far fought. I want to say here and now that there is no woman who has been fought. It's the women who should know their responsibility of respect and showing good example to the leadership that are in place. In Ephesians 5, 6, it says, submit to the authorities and serve wholeheartedly. And this is what the women should be. So mine is to echo what my Ndeleo is doing, and the message should go very loud to the to the whole country, as I congratulate the president for these changes. We said here a few months ago that we need respect for authorities, mm -hmm. and I'll still continue to say that there is no country that will govern without respect of its people, and it is a duty for the people to respect the authority, and that is why we issued a statement here saying the country, the young politicians, deserves to respect the authorities. So I support what the changes that are taking place now, and every sober-minded Kenyan should be see fit and support it.